Mar seemed like just a real defensive struggle. Both teams didn't shoot the ball great. How much of that was due to the defense each team was playing? Yeah, I mean, some of it may be due to the defense. Some of it, I feel like our guys was a little fatigued today. Um, you know, they got a chance to sit and wait for us. We played yesterday. Um, we, we had some guys that play a lot of minutes on this team because this league is so tough. We need our guys to win games. So, you know, some banged up guys in there. We didn't have a shoot around. Um, no excuses. You know, them guys came out there and they won anymore. What makes their pick and roll and lob passes so difficult to defend? Good players. <laughs> you know, when you got Harris, you know, he's, he's a monster getting downhill. He can finish going both ways. And then when you when you want to help on him, then you got an athlete like Adams. You could just throw the ball up to him, and, he, and he's catching everything you throw up there. And you know it's, it's challenging to try to figure out ways to guard it. Feels like this team has a couple guys that could do things like that in the future as they learn how to play uh, a little bit more. Pat James, guys like that. I mean, do you see that potential there? I mean, hopefully, you know, hopefully, you know, we all these all these guys, you know, get better and get better and. You know, we, we, can, we can start to, I mean, even, even we've done it at times, you know. These guys are young, and, you know, ho hopefully they get there one day. From your experience, what's the thing you have to do to put conference tournament behind you, get ready for NCAA? You just got to get mentally and physically there. You know, it's, it's a new season, and anything can happen in, in NCAA tournament. We see it every year, and we just got to go in there and prepare and, you know, believe we got a chance to win it all. What do you tell players? I mean, you know, you're kind of in a unique situation and you're coming in still, I don't want to say the new guy, but still kind of feeling your way, getting along with that. What's your message? What do you try to pass along about playing in the NCAA? Um, well, I only played in one. Yeah. You know, <laughs> I've, I've been on the staff right. and a few of them with Mick Cronin, but it, it just, just what I was just saying, you know, it's a new season. It, we just got to believe in ourselves, you know, follow the game plan and put everything out there because for some of the seniors, this is your last chance. Some young guys, this is an opportunity you may never get again. You may never make it to the NCAA tournament again. So you got you know, to be in it. You got to be focused mentally and physically. You got to be ready and believe you can win it. I mean, you kind of knew that too. You knew this that was going to be your only chance when you played, right? So you were kind of in that mindset, right? right? Exactly. I knew. I mean, for me, I, I knew, but all these kids, not everybody like me. Not, not everybody know they're going to be a top NBA pick. You know, some of these guys, it might be the last time they play, you know, basketball. And, you know, you got to cherish it.